before we start, I want to tell you, if you don't have our paints, you can use the plain background. So our winter trees need a pretty sky, so we're using bleeding tissue paper. I'm using cool colors, but you can use the warm colors or make a different color sky. All you need is water. To keep my fingers mostly clean, I use a brush to spread my colors. You can also wet your paper and lay colors down like a square sky and let it dry that way too. But the way I'm painting is to move the tissue around to use more of its color and also let some of my colors bleed into each other, which you'll see in a second. Now we're going to add the trees to our picture and it helps to peel long pieces for the trunk and um, the way I'm doing this is I'm using the grain of the paper. If it's not peeling and it's doing little tiny pieces, you're going against the grain, which is good for tiny branches. If you want tall trees, you can combine long pieces together. If you want short pieces, they could have baby trees, logs, things that are falling. Um, and when you glue this, try to use a little bit of glue. I'm barely squeezing the glue bottle. If you have too much glue, it just gets gooey and icky and slides, it gets slippery. And it might slide off and move where you don't want it to go. And then the same for the tiny branches, you can do little ones. One tip for making branches is that big branches can go at the bottom and tiny little branches can go near the top and that will help. And here I'm just smearing the glue so I'm not using a lot. You could make um, pine trees which would just be like a triangle shape but here I'm trying to use winter trees that have lost their leaves. Here I'm starting to add the snow. Now if you want smooth snow, like for sledding, you could use scissors. Here I'm using more of a rough tearing to make it look like fresh snow. And once you glue this down, you can add anything to this. Maybe snowman, or you could draw um, the footprints of a person walking, or an animal that was walking through the forest. Um, be creative and I hope you have fun. The last thing I do to embellish my picture is I add a little bit of snow texture um, for the glitter. I always have to have glitter in my winter projects. So the thing that helped me the most was to put glue on the tops of the branches, not the bottom or around and or on top of it. And then I did a little bit in the sky for some stars. Um, let an adult help you with glitter. Or if maybe you already have glitter glue, and that would help a lot too. Just let it dry and don't put anything on top of it. 